As the year wraps, we know so many small businesses won't return next year because of the pandemic. COVID-19 has been really hard on the restaurant industry and News Channel 5's Kelsey Gibbs spoke with the owner of one shop who sadly is closing his doors today. Um, it's like cheers. They can come in here and we know their name. More than a decade ago, Curtis Kubley took over as the owner of Sub Depot. It's always been uh, really a nice place where, where people could go and, and have a sandwich. We're in a business complex around here. A place where the regulars like Marvin Grimes keep coming back. They have wonderful service. The food is fantastic. It's just a really nice place to come. Grimes says the best treat you can buy here is friendship. The people, the relationships that uh, I have developed over the years. But like a lot of small businesses, Kubli has faced hardships. Nearly two years ago, he noticed school buses taking over his parking lot. And when he went to look for a new location, he learned his lease wouldn't be renewed. And then came 2020. And then to make things even more difficult, that's when the pandemic started. Sub Depot had to close for about a month and a half. I had to lay off my employees. Then I decided to try and try and come back. Kubli says he tried bouncing back, but with no permanent location and loss of revenue, it was too big of a challenge. Today's our last day. I can't find a place to go. He says Nashville stay at home orders just hit the sandwich shop too hard. He says not enough relief help went to small businesses. I'm in a business complex when when so many people are working from home. That was my bread and butter. And now customers and staff are sad to see things go. I was devastated. I had no idea. Fighting back tears, it's clear to Kubli and others, this place will be missed. It's tough. It is. Kelsey Gibbs, News Channel 5.